As Aston Villa dish out astronomical wages and Newcastle's newfound financial might bears fruit, clubs across Europe might wonder if the Super League already exists in the form of the Premier League. Despite the new money and the growing wage bill, both clubs may struggle to crack the top four. In the last 20 years, only nine Premier League teams have done that, with Leicester, Newcastle and Everton breaking the monopoly held by Chelsea, Manchester United, Arsenal, Liverpool, Manchester City and Tottenham. Six English teams have featured in the last five Champions League finals and the perceived dominance will only be reinforced if the Premier League earns a fifth group stage slot with competition reforms. To make it big, Villa have spent big, with Philippe Coutinho, Danny Ings, Diego Carlos and Bubacar Kamara earning well over 100,000 a week. With Steven Gerrard eyeing Europe, expect their wage bill, which rose by 29 million in 2020-21, to rise further. Kamara choosing 14th place Villa over Champions League football at Atletico Madrid gives further credence that the Premier League is its very own Super League. Since the Premier League started publishing annual agent fees relating to transfers in 2015, the richest league in the world has forked out an incredible £1.5 billion on fees alone. According to Transfer Marks, from 2015-16, Premier League clubs spent £10.8 billion in transfer fees for just over 2,500 players, recouping roughly half in transfer income. The next highest spending top five league, Serie A, spent $6.65 billion on over 6,000 transfers, with $5.53 billion in transfer income. La Liga's $4.96 billion and Bundesliga's $3.95 billion were also far behind the Premier League. Both kept balances below a billion at minus $643 million and minus $440 million. Liga turned a $257 million profit on their transfers balance sheet, while Portugal made a staggering $1.3 billion profit in the same period. Premier League TV revenue has put English clubs at a distinct advantage over their continental counterparts and success for Villa or Newcastle would consolidate the league's Super League status.